Hey everyone, we're here today at the Townwide Fund of Huntington and we love to celebrate local and so do they. So I'm going to introduce you guys to the president, Greg Kennedy, and the executive director, Alice Marie Rourke. How are you guys doing today? Excellent. Thank you Excellent. for having us. Excellent. So happy to have you here. Glad to be here. We want to know all about the Townwide Fund and what you guys provide. So Greg, tell me what it's all about. Well, I've been with the Townwide Fund since 2008 and over the course of those years I've seen us grow in strength and in numbers uh, by adding quality leaders in the community to our board. Um, we'll conti continue to do what we do for as long as we have to. Uh, we enjoy doing it uh, and there's nothing more important than helping the less fortunate in the Huntington community. I love that. Alice Marie, what is your favorite part about working with Townwide Fund? Your favorite part of your job? Oh my gosh, my favorite part of, of uh, working with, well first and foremost, the board of directors are great. They, we've all become uh, very good friends and I love that part of it. But just being out in the community and knowing the work that we do and the, and the, and the hard work that we do with the, with the you know, everyone working together for the purpose of helping people in need in our community, it's, it's just very rewarding and it's actually a privilege to do that. So, yeah. So what kind of events do you guys have that helps raise money that you can allocate to our, our grants and everything else we put out for the year? So we have a multitude of events actually. In the beginning of the year we started this year with Pickleball which was unbelievable. It was just a wonderful, very successful event and we will be doing it again it's a new soon. Event, right? It was a new event that we added this year and quite popular so we're very excited about that. Um, and then we go right into uh, the golf outing in spring which is at the Cold Spring uh, Country Club. That was moved now to June 8th so if anyone Ooh. out there would like to golf you can still sign up and golf. Uh, that's Cold Spring as I mentioned and then we have the gala which is our largest event um, at Ohika Castle on June 1st. That's going to be amazing. It's called the Stroll of the Castle, and it's just going to be a very immersive, wonderful experience from the food to the entertainment to the prizes yeah. and everything. Um, then um, after that, we have our um, IPA and Rosé event in September, which is uh, going to be at the seminary up on uh, West Neck Road in Lloyd Harbor. That's a wonderful uh, wine tasting event. We're going to be honoring our dear friends and member agency, North Shore Holiday House. And in that same month, we have the um, East End Golf. Golf is one of our most popular events. That's going to be at the West Hampton Country Club on September 21st. And then, of course, the infamous Thanksgiving run. Say, the 2,200 yeah. runners. And, yeah, come on down and join us on that day. You know, Thanksgiving morning, it's a great way to burn off the calories and help those in need in our community. 100%. Speaking of that, how can someone just on the streets come out and help the organization? That's what can we do? Question. So we have volunteer opportunities, and you can always reach out to us online. Line. Um, and then you can also consider joining the board. The board of directors is a great way to um, get involved and get a real uh, bird's eye view of what we do. We raise money to support the health and human service agencies in the town of Huntington. And we do that by you know hosting events, donor appeals, corporate sponsor appeals, and I'd be very you know remiss if I didn't mention all of the corporate sponsors, which yeah. we can you know show at the end of the video. 100%. But just um, just getting involved in, in any way possible to you know do the, what's right in the community. Oh, right, Mandy? <laughs> Mandy wants her moment. I Let's know. just be honest here. Everybody, have you met Mandy yet? Mandy is the mascot of the Townwide Fund. <laughs> and she was getting jealous and annoyed she was not part of the interview. Are you happy now? <laughs> Are you a good girl? She's like front and center. I'm good. <laughs> All right. So I want to ask you, too, a lot of the grants went out last year. How much did you guys actually give out last year? With, uh, if you include the emergency grants, because a lot of the food pantries are um, empty, yes. uh, it's been a very difficult year. We gave out about two hundred and twenty-five thousand dollars. Oh my God! Yeah, that is all great. in all. Yeah. Well, some of reasons, I think we actually know, like uh, General Needs yes. and Maggie's sure. Mission. Yeah, sure. yeah. Yep. You know, plenty of them. We have uh, uh, this year. Uh, in the beginning of the year, we gave to Gloria Day. Um, we gave to um, ha Helping Hands Mission on several occasions. We gave to uh, St. Hugh of Lincoln, their pantry, their mm -hmm. food pantry. Mm -hmm. It's been a very uh, interesting three years to watch how the community has been in so much need in so many ways and uh, again I'd be remiss if I didn't mention mental health we've been working with uh, you know LICAD and we've been working with um, CN Guidance uh, the youth in our community need our support more than ever before uh, COVID really did a number on a 100%. lot of the way people uh, operated mm -hmm. through those very difficult months and on top of that the price of food which yeah. we're all struggling Huge. with and we look sure. at the food pantries Debbie Rimler at Tricy YA another member agency we're doing what we can to raise money so that when it does come time for either an emergency grant or a regular grant season we are in a ready position to just give them what they need that's a great you know call. and I like to say it's one-stop shopping if you donate to the Townwide Fund, do you help us? We, in turn, 
it goes a long way. One donation touches many lives. And I read too that money in Huntington stays in Huntington, right? You yes. raise it here, it stays in Huntington, which yes. is huge. Yes. I know a lot of places doesn't actually always happen, so love that about that. Yes. Now, local businesses, how can they get involved with stuff? Can they do donations for raffles and that kind of stuff as absolutely, well? Absolutely, absolutely. And everyone gets a piece of the pie. Is if you're you know willing to work with us in any way, whether it be you know donation for a raffle or sponsorship or an auction prize or something, you will get recognition. You know via yeah. our printed mm -hmm. materials mm -hmm. or you know sometimes we'll do it. You know we'll put it on the website or. Anything like that. So it's all, you know, we like to include everybody in yes. some way. All right, so for information, where can they go, Greg? Uh, well, we have our, our website uh, and, and stop in. I mean, you know, we're always here. Townwidefund.org. Uh, Townwidefund.org. Yep. Um, you and know, uh, yeah. there is nothing greater than, you know, helping the less fortunate in the community. Um, so consider joining the board. It is a great group of people. Uh, I'm humbled to work with such a wonderful group and honored to be the president of the Town Wine Fund. And like I said, we have fun doing it. And I apologize that the, the mascot's getting in your way. No, we but, love it. Uh, and you put the fun in Town Wide Fun, let's be honest. You know what? We do. You do. Yeah, we That's do. what it's all about. Too, yeah. I we love do. that line. That's a good one. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for your time. We so appreciate it. Make sure to go to their website. Check out the events they have coming up. You have the golf adding on June 8th. Yeah. You have the gala on June 1st. Yeah. And you have I Pay and Rosé. May 17th. I think I might have missed that one before. We have a beautiful oh. tennis outing on May 17th at the Huntington Crescent Club honoring uh, Annette Comer, who was also a local resident who grew up here. And it's going to be a very, very fun day. So we're looking forward to that as well. And Don't September, miss out. September 21st is the West Hampton yep. golf outing. So that's, that'll be, that's always a fun day. Yeah, and the Thanksgiving run. And come that's join right. us. We have a lot of fun here at the fund. That's, that's right. right. Yeah. Thank you guys so much. Stay tuned for more. Thank you.